Okay, it looks like I'm starting. Hi, welcome to my kitchen. Uh, you're going to watch me make celery juice this morning. Hi, this is Lorraine Purcell. Welcome to Fairy Godmother Monday. This is where we get together and we make our own dreams come true in the quantum field of all possibilities. I'm going to get my computer set up while I do the deal here. I just walked in from the grocery store. Got beautiful lemons, tomatoes, mushrooms, two watermelons. I want to show you these watermelons. Oh, wait, I'll just show them to you that is. Okay, check it out. Do you see all that? Can you see all those little things like this right here? These right here, can you see my finger? I can't see what you're seeing. Okay, like this. Those are bee bites, ah, sorry. Those are bee bites, and uh, they go after the sweet melons. That's one of the ways you can tell that it's gonna be sweet, is if it has bee bites in it. They get on and they eat the rind, because, hi sister, because it's sweet. So, you have got me in my kitchen this morning. I am just washing my celery. Welcome, welcome. So let's begin breathing and grounding to Mother Day, or Mother, Mother Day, to Mother Earth into her message for you. We love you, Mother Earth. What do you require from us today? What do you require from us today? <sighs> today is the day we're going to go into the quantum field together, which is always so awesome. With our desire. Here are the frogs out there. <laughs> And the pond is filling, which is wonderful. We still have one giant carp left from the fallout of the drought. Had a little bit of a drought here. I'm on day, I don't know what it is, but I have six more days on my 28-day cleanse. I actually put it on my calendar, 654321, because next Sunday, I'm going to celebrate with two Amy's gluten-free, dairy-free burritos and salsa that has no citric acid in it and no natural flavors in it. And then I'll be back on, you know, my strict thing, except I will be steaming potatoes. Everything has been raw. It's completely raw. Uh, for the last 28 days. Well, let's see, 28, so 22 days. So, yeah, it's been a little bit of a wild ride. So, Mother Earth, what is your message to us? What do you require of us? She's just kind of beaming and smiling at me right now. with everything I'm doing. I'm getting the message that as we take care of our body, we're actually taking care of Mother Earth too. I love you six so much. I'm so blessed to have you as my big sis. <laughs> Thank you, Janine. Good morning, Georgia in Australia. Yes. So now I'm going to, I don't think there's anything else. I probably should put the bananas in. Hang on. Washing the bananas, getting everybody's cooties off of them. This is a big part of it. Getting everybody else's pathogens off. I'm not always this thorough, but 
um, because I have this basin of beautiful water with soap in it, I'm going to let it continue filling as I rinse my celery. Vicki, good morning. All the love and the care that it takes to eat the way I've been eating for the last 22 days. You know, I guess this is what it takes. No more grab and go except for prep before. The only thing in the market that I can grab and go with is uh, there's an organic dried uh, mango that I can eat, not now, because it's not fully reconstituted, fully constituted, but um, that's the only thing I can grab in the market. Everything else has to be washed, and you don't have access to washing when you go to the market. You're a grab-and-go person, so I have to do so much prep in advance to get this all happening. Darcy, you're here! How was your birthday, girl? Darcy had a birthday on Friday, as a lot of you know. Yeah, so Mother Earth is just smiling. She's so happy with what I'm doing because she's saying that as you take care of your body, you're taking care of me. Wow. I had no idea. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Thank you, God. 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 Do you guys know? That more than anything in the world, I want to be connected to the divine. That's it. It's always been my desire. Just be connected to the divine, period. I want to be, I want to know the mystical. I am a modern day mystic. You probably are too, by being here and being attracted to this space. Because this is all we do here, is spirit stuff. I am only interested in being connected to the divine. I wanted to be a nun when I was six. <laughs> and now I'm married to Jesus. All I want to do is know the divine. Follow the divine. Okay, this sink is getting mega full. So, if that means I need to stop. All right. So this is a little bit tricky. I want to put you where you can see a little bit closer, maybe. There's my juicer all set up over here. Oops. Yeah, it's very much a labor of love, the way I do it. Care that I have to go into with all the shopping and the washing and the prepping. But boy, I'm telling you. Oh, go. Still got my purse on. to have a healthy body. I'm down with it. So tell me about your weekend. I went surfing. That was very exhilarating. I rode in five times um, for about, I'm guessing about the length of a half a football field. I really don't know, but it's pretty long. I'm going to continue. It was such a blast. I thought maybe hmm, four months before it turns kind of chilly here.
So just keep reading, get your message from Mother Earth, drop it in the comments. Being on this cleanse has really shown me the importance of eating the way I've been eating and doing the celery juice every day and the heavy metal detox smoothie and the lemon water when I first wake up. I mean, I, my diet is impeccable now for food is medicine. And thank you. I'm so thankful for that shingles outbreak to give me, give me my wake up call. Our body just takes so much, does so much. And we just kind of take it for granted. We have to totally, totally support it. Because it's not like it was when our parents were growing up. We've got toxins everywhere. We have to be very, very, very proactive with our body and our health. And so now, I remember my grandma, Grandma Jessie Janine, saying uh, something about, you know, live to eat, you need to live. Like, something about food wasn't for pleasure, it was for sustenance. And she was a diabetic. And, um, you know, she had to really be careful of what she ate. But, you know, alcohol is completely out of the picture for me forever. Which is fine. We just learn all the things that are contributing to your ailment. This pathogen, this shingles virus, whatever it is, shingles virus, probably more, probably Epstein Barr, I don't know. Uh, just it's gonna have no no hope inside of me because I'm not gonna let it I'm not gonna give it any pathogens to live on. So this 28 days has been uh, a recalibration for me. And made me really think about everything I put into my body. Okay, that's about ready. Maybe one more stock. Kathy, good morning. Surfing's fun. Planning a trip to Myrtle Beach next year. My RV fixed. Oh, that's nice. Darlene, welcome. Everybody say welcome to Darlene, a new visitor. Welcome, Darlene. Where in the world are you? getting everything out of plastic as soon as I get it home and putting it in this net and then I put it in a plastic bag so that it stays crisp. I can miss something here. Okay. to strain the celery juice. Oh, it's funny. This morning at the market, somebody I rarely talk to, she's like, yeah, you're the celery lady. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I don't mind being known as the celery lady. Okay. Now I'm going to strain it. So this is my morning ritual, 32 ounces of this every day, every morning on an empty stomach after a quart of lemon water. That's a quart.
quart of filtered water with a whole lemon in it. And last night I put some thyme sprigs in it from my garden. This thyme is an antiviral and it stays in your blood, which makes it really beneficial because it means while you're sleeping or doing whatever, it's still working. Okay, I'm ready. Thanks for your patience. I was getting this organized. Here we go. Over to my desk. The sky this morning, the clouds are so beautiful. I sent Janine a text. It's so, it just brought tears to my eyes. It's so beautiful. grab my phone so I can show you that picture of the sky. So check this picture out. This is luminous, so beautiful. Darcy, hi Lorraine, yes, I've had a great birthday and went to the Saratoga racetrack and sat in the clubhouse seats. A beautiful sunny 85 degree day. 85 is a nice temperature. And went out to dinner with my family on Saturday. My son Colin and I went to the movies to see Elvis with my aunt and cousin who had not, I had not seen in 35 years. Lots of fun yesterday. Had a birthday barbecue. Oh, that's just wonderful, Darcy. So glad you had such a good birthday. So did I miss anything up here when you guys were rolling in? Vicki, keep the prayers coming. Spent over six hours in the ER on Friday, spinning crazy dizzy, perforated right eardrum. Amen. I was by the stove to hold on, and I would have fallen in my ER room. The TV kept coming on and wouldn't shut off of ghosts and spirits. Shows it was a trip on meds for dizziness. I'm in turtle mode. Poor baby. Send energy to Vicky. Hi, Sean. Glad you're here. Oh, man. So, Vicky, we're sending you lots of energy right now. Lots of energy. 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 Yes. Okay, Vicki, we've got you. We're holding you. For anyone who wants to get my five most important affirmations that I've ever used to get me out of the dumpster and get me on a higher place, we have a um, free thing going on right now. It's right here. www three keys to self love dot com forward slash freebie dash affirmations get this beautiful PDF that's print worthy you can put it all over your house the five most important affirmations that I have ever used for myself and my thousands of clients around the world um, so let me just double check three keys to self love.com forward slash freebie dash affirmations. Okay. Yeah. So just go there and grab it and you will love it.
Thank you, 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 thank you. We are so thankful, God. We are so thankful, 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 we are so thankful. Fairy Godmother Monday, get in touch with your dreams. Get in touch with your dreams. Get in touch with your dreams. Your dreams is how God speaks to you. It's the experience that God wants to experience through you is why you have the desire. Desire means of the Father, desire. And so acknowledge your desires. Know that they are from God and just stay with it and feel it, feel it, feel it, feel it, feel it, feel it, feel it. The quantum field is like gravity. It doesn't give you attachment to the earth, it just is. So the quantum field is anything that you put attention on, it changes it from wave to particle. Oh, great. Yeah, it's in your email, Janine. So Janine signed up for it. So as we focus on something, we turn it from the wave up. Because in the infinite field, the quantum field, it's all possibilities. All possibilities. All possibilities are there. The good and the bad. Every single possibility is there. What we focus on is what we actually turn into reality. It turns it from wave of all possibilities to a thing, to particle. Okay, so what are we focusing on? What are we focusing on? This is uh, really profound stuff, you guys. Really profound stuff. Oh, so what are we focusing on? That's why it says in the Bible, think on these things. Whatever is good, honorable, joyful, pleasant, loving, whatever. Oh, I'm still looking forward to getting it. Yes, it's the five most important affirmations that I have used. And for those of you who don't know me, I um, am a marriage, family, and child counselor for almost three decades. I've been a coach. And um, so this is going into my 28th year. And um, I suffered with lifelong depression with suicidal ideations most of that time, my entire life, except for a few uh, years ago. I got off of an 18-year addiction to Zoloft. That was a ride, and so now it's a ride of taking it straight and not taking any medication. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with anybody taking medication, right, because I took it for 18 years. But um, I was able to get off with the help of a coach. and. Um, I just couldn't get off. I couldn't get off, no matter what I tried. And when I tried, those of you who've been on that and tried to get off, you know it gets worse. Whatever you were feeling before, it gets more intense when you when you go off the feelings. I'm going to move over underneath my halo as the modern day mystic that I am. All I want is God. All I want is God. All I want is God in alignment with God and divine affluence. Divine affluence. Not affluence of my own making. Divine affluence as I listen and am obedient to what I feel spirit coming through me. That's when the affluence comes. Not, not my strength. God's strength. Not my strength, God's strength. Not my strength, God's strength. Who's with me? I'm not interested in what I can do. I'm only interested in what God can do through me. Everything always works out for me. There's nothing but the stream of well-being. And it's just, what are we focusing on? The stream of well-being or the bullshit that's all around us? Can we send love to the bullshit 
and say thank you very much for sharing and then go another direction in the direction of the stream of well-being because whatever we focus on turns it from the wave of all possibilities infinite possibilities it means every possibility the good and the bad and that's why I unplugged from the media because it makes it hard not to focus on the bad right so then you bring more of that energy into your life no thank you that's their energy that's somebody else's decision that's somebody else's creation I'm not wanting anything to do with it except from a heart of compassion sending light and love to those because innocently we get into these quagmires innocently innocently we get into these quagmires so what is your dream what's your dream what's your dream get into this feel it feel it feel it universe only hears what we feel universe only hears what we feel mary made it yay mayor whatever you had to do to get here i applaud you universe only hears our feeling if we're feeling shitty and down in the dumps which happens to me universe hears that and gives us more of it so we need to find something to turn it around fast and to me it's looking at the trees knowing that there's only love there is only love I have had awakenings where I've been, I've had to shut it off and I'm, I'm turning it back on now where the leaves on the trees are just blasting me with love and it's been so strong that I had to turn it off so I could just function <laughs> but I'm turning it back on that just means when you awaken when you're awakened you never really go back you know you might you might turn it off for a little while but it's uh, it's yours it's yours yes 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 so what is your dream my dream and while you're doing this set your intention for the week Diane yes glad you're here Diane from Sarasota Florida set your intention with your desire that was me this last weekend and Abraham turned me around whatever you have to do Abraham always does it for me I spent uh, most of yesterday afternoon recording um, like Abraham after Abraham after Abraham because I listen to it all night long when I'm sleeping because I want that in me I want I want to know truth I don't want to know reality I want to know truth so yes, yes, yes. Whatever you need to do to turn yourself around because universe, uh, let's just say the quantum field, gives you whatever you're feeling. Universe only hears. Our words help us get to there, help us get to the feeling, but universe does not hear our words. Universe just hears our feeling. So our words are the, the portal for us to get in and... Um, enter the bliss that we want to keep replicating and keep replicating and keep replicating and keep replicating and keep replicating if you find yourself in a little you know eddy like in a stream where there's just like it the, the leaves just kind of it's like off to the side and there's like this little dead spot and it can't move if you find yourself in that situation these five affirmations are going to help you so much so the link is up above it's also in the description Go ahead and grab that, my gift to you. <clears throat> so hold your vision right now. Hold your vision, hold your vision, hold your vision, hold your vision. Feel it, feel it, feel it in every cell of your body. 
divine affluence is mine divine affluence divine affluence meaning it's coming to me with um, ease and grace and flow as I'm obedient to everything the very the very nudges the very whispers in my ears from the angels from from spirit I am not moving until I feel source until I feel the pull, I will not move. I will not move. Divine affluence. Divine affluence and divine influence, period. That's the definition of all I desire in this life, is to be in line with the divine. Just be in line with the divine. Be in line with the divine. Be in line with the divine. Everyone put your hand on your heart and on your gut and say, yes, 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 I say yes to me. I say yes to me and my desires. I say yes to me as a vessel of God. I say yes to me. And you are drawn to this space because you are also a modern day mystic. That means all you desire is alignment with God. It's all I desire. It's all I've ever desired. My entire life. I'm so thankful. I'm so thankful. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And as we spend time in thankfulness, it is as if that thing, we already have it, and that's the spot where we just are collapsing time and space. Dream is to be healed and whole, off my oxygen machine, spine healed, and this crap loosen up in my ears. To be able to walk around my town without needing oxygen to live my happy life. Meanwhile, still living my happy life on oxygen, and so grateful for another day. The other day, I had a dragonfly the size of my whole hand fly at me. I was talking to it, trying to get it to land on my hand. Amazing, the huge size of this beauty. Shine, light, everybody. Prayers to the universe. Love, 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 Vicki. Love, love. Just love. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, Kath, thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. We'll see you on Friday. So that thing that we desire, feel it, is if it is happening now. There's a big difference between acting as if and fake it till you make it. It's act as if. Fake it as you make it is the masculine er, energy. This is acting as if, just like when we were little kids, playing dress up, right? So acting as if we're putting on those clothes of that person. What would that person be eating? What would they, I'll tell you what, the, my future self will be eating this way. The way I eat now, so hooked into raw fruits and vegetables, no junk ever again, you know, I mean, I can't say ever again, but just really, 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 really taking care of this temple. Really taking care of this temple. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Supporting my body in every way that it needs. Gone are the days when our body would just take care of itself because now the toxins and the viruses are so prevalent that we must be completely proactive to clean our body of all viruses and then keep our body environment such that none of these viruses can exist. Because if we don't, <laughs> this is what I've learned, if we don't, we're just going to get sicker and sicker and sicker with these mystery illnesses. Denise from Australia, hello. Gidget here. <laughs> so 
So hold the feeling, hold the feeling, hold the feeling, hold the feeling, and give thanks for it now. Let's just give thanks for our desire right now. Oh. Yes, yes. And my intention for this week is to stay deeply connected to the divine. my one and only desire. Okay, my loves. Let's send this beautiful energy out to the entire planet. Feel the white light coming out of your hands as you circle the planet energetically. Sending this peace and this joy and this love and that, this bliss to them. May every being be blessed. May all beings 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 be blessed. I am witnessing all these mystery illnesses on a daily basis. My husband keeps meeting people who are cleansing. Yeah, I'm on day 22, I think, of 28 days, and it has completely reset me. Yes, we'll do a card, Denise. It completely reset me, and I did it to reset me, like reset my eating habits. Make you grateful for every second of every minute of every hour of every day. Wishing you... All an amazing day full of love, laughter, peace, and lots of self-love and kindness. Janine, best day ever, everyone. Yes, 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 yes. Every water molecule on the planet getting blessed. Every fish, every mammal, every water molecule in every single human being, every water molecule in the oceans and all the waterways and every water molecule and every plant, oh, every wall, every house. Yes, 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 You'll survive this, new solutions and beginnings. Inner earth, look at that. Inner earth, you'll survive this. New solutions, new beginnings. Yes, mystery illnesses, if you wanna get your mystery illnesses solved, study Anthony William. You're amazing, Lorraine. You really listen on every level to everything and take inspiring actions. Thank you, Denise. That is my one and only goal and ambition. That right there. To listen on every level to everything and take inspiring action. That's the only action I will take. Even, even when it comes to paying my bills or opening envelopes, I will wait. I will wait until I'm aligned. Okay, so what is this? Inner Earth. Inner Earth. 80. Inner Earth, also known as Agartha, <clears throat> is believed to be a hidden subterranean world within the planet itself. Many ancient cultures mention it in their stories. It's said that some of the beings of ancient lost lands, such as Lemuria, Atlantis, and I've never heard of this one before, Aryavarta, went there. Hindu and Celtic lore mention caves and entrances to underground worlds. Tibetan Buddhism 
refers to the secret mystical city Shambhala, which is thought to be located in the Himalayas. I believe all of it. Yeah, Denise, beautifully, beautiful, totally resonates with me, that card. Yes, yes, yes. Many have searched for inner earth in the physical world, but without success. So the mystery continues. Is it a place that exists in the physical or on another level of consciousness? There are solutions beyond what you can perceive, surprising out outcomes to your problems and situations. <laughs> Resolutions that are the best interests of all involved. If you find yourself facing an obstacle or feeling stuck and have no idea what to do, you're being reassured that there is a way out. You'll survive this and things will work out. I'm going to read that again. If you find yourself facing an obstacle or feeling stuck, and have no idea what to do. You're being reassured that there is a way out. You'll survive this and things will work out. If you're stuck in a rut, do something to shake up the energy and shift your thinking. Try something you wouldn't normally do. Surfing. Mine is in my mind, my mystical, magical garden. I love going there in meditation. So sweet. Uh, if you're stuck or in a rut, do something to shake up the energy and shift your thinking. Try something you wouldn't normally do. Soon you'll see the whole new worlds of solutions are available. Things that were previously beyond your focus will present themselves. Things that were previously beyond your focus will present themselves. Helpful people, signs from the universe, and support in both expected and unexpected ways are on their way to you. But first, you need to do something different to shift your focus so you can receive them. Starseed Soul, Star Seed Soul Inquiry. What can you do to shift your energy or your outlook? We were talking about that earlier. Universe will give us whatever we're feeling. Give us more. Oh, you like that? We'll give you more of it. So, we need to find some way to get ourselves out of this shithole that we find ourselves in emotionally sometimes. Anything. Grab one of these replays. Go to my Facebook page and just listen to one of these replays because this is all we talk about here is connection with spirit, connection with spirit, connection with spirit, connection to your divinity, <clears throat> knowing your divinity, knowing that you're infinite. That's all we talk about here. And if you're here, this is who you are also. I'm preaching to the choir. Janine, that one is so spot on. Love it. Yes, it was. Thank you so much. I was really stuck. I can feel... I'm moving that big rock out of my way. The solutions are there. I know it is. Yes, 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 yes. When we tap into the truth that there is nothing but the stream of well-being, we tap into the truth that there is nothing but the stream of well-being. We tap into the truth that there is nothing but the stream of well-being. We tap into the truth that there is nothing but the stream of well-being. And as we focus on it, it expands. Georgia, wouldn't, would meditation be good? This card is my perfect card. Yes, meditation would be very good, Georgia. Denise. Yes. Yes, Georgia. With your injury, yes. Meditation. When you meditate, feel yourself completely healed. When you're meditating, feel yourself completely and utterly healed healed feel it you have to feel it as if it's happening now feel it as if it's happening now and then the molecules in your body will start rearranging instantly well my loves this has been so much fun i love you i appreciate you thank you for being such a vital part of my life you want to get educated about how to guard yourself uh, and be proactive 
for health in this day and age, I highly recommend uh, you can reach out to me, private message me, and um, I can share with you how to get hooked into the information. Sure, okay, I'll try that. Yes, yes, there's nothing but hang out here. I'm here every Monday and Friday, 8 a.m. Eastern. Um, Facebook.com forward slash Lorraine Purcell MA. Um, Yeah, vital, you guys, vital. We can no longer sit back. We can no longer sit back and just expect our body to clean up the crap that we put in. Our livers are exhausted. Our blood is thick with all the fats that we're putting in. The food we're putting in our body is feeding the pathogens and the viruses in our body, and then the viruses and the pathogens in our body poop and then now we've got neurotoxins, and it, our whole body is just the soup of just feeding toxins, feeding toxins, feeding toxins, feeding these viruses like the shingles outbreak that I had. I got so educated, you guys. And you know how it is with me. As soon as I learn something, I, my first thing after I get myself in order is I pass it on to you. So if we want to have vibrant, weightless lives, we need to really be proactive and clean up the viruses and the pathogens and the toxins in our body. And it is a body of work, I'll tell you. <laughs> it is a body of work. I'm on 22 of 28. Today's my 22nd day. On Saturday, I will have finished my 28 days of my nothing but raw fruits and vegetables um, and a bajillion supplements from a really pure supplement com company to starve out the shingles virus and the herpes virus in me. Denise, that's exactly true. We need to clean, clean, clean us and home. Yes, yes, yes. So anybody want to know how I've been doing this? reach out to me on private message. Okay, I love you. Keep with your intention all week. Mine is to stay aligned with the divine. I'm gonna write that down on a card so I can remember. Intention. Let me do it in orange. Stay aligned with divine. It's all I want in the world. I want nothing else. It's my life in a nutshell. Stay aligned with the divine. Okay, sweeties. Until I see you on Friday, sending you so many blessings. Hold the vision, hold the vision, hold the vision, hold the vision, hold the vision. Without a vision, the people perish. Without a vision, the people perish. Denise, mine is to stay present and listen to myself. Love, love, love. Okay, my sweeties, thank you so much for being here. I'll see you Friday. Facebook.com forward slash Lorraine Purcell MA. Um, remember, go to three keys to self love.com forward slash freebie dash affirmations to get my five most critical affirmations that I've used in my almost three decades of coaching and counseling people and what have saved me. The link is in the description and it's also in the comments. Oh, maybe I'll pin it.
that's weird. I know I put it in here. Oh. Um, okay, I'm going to put it in here again. <clears throat> this is free, my gift to you. www.3keys2selflove.com forward slash F R E E B I E dash A F F I R M A P I O N S. 3keys2selflove.com forward slash freebie dash affirmations. Like that. And now I'm going to pin it. Can I pin it? Pin, yes. Healing Affirmations Guide, you guys. My Healing Affirmations Guide. Go and grab that now. And I will see you Friday, if not before. Mwah. Sending you so much love. Bye for now.